Greetings everyone, TJ here with another vlog and haul video. Today, I'm going to be going to the Lego store to secure Ninjago City Markets. Let's go. Okay, we have an update. What's up guys? We are here at Northbrook Court, the Northbrook Court Lego store here 10 a.m. June 1st. Yep. Not a pack line yet, but uh, regardless, yep. it's good to get here early. Yeah, only a few people so far. I have an hour to wait. Store store trip is done, which is over here. We had we, a little bit of hauling and balling. Yeah, we have secured the package. And also got a GWP for me. I did plan on getting one of the spinners, but apparently their Ninjago sets aren't ringing in other than the markets, so I couldn't get one. And it happens. Happens to the best of us. And, and Richie, which one is it that you couldn't get? I could not get any of the friends sets. So I was really interested in that botanical garden set. I had my eyes on it. I come to the store. I'm thinking it's coming out August 1st. And I find out it's June 1st. I'm like, oh, we're so bad. And they come out five minutes before the store is open. Hey, we have, pro we have a problem ringing up 33 items. And unfortunately, the friends sets were on that list. So... Thankfully, they hooked me up with a gift with purchase. I'm coming back tomorrow to get that set. So we're all we're all good in many ways, but you know it happened. And then you got the. Uh, Let's see it? what I did get. Yeah. So thankfully, they did still hook me up with the gift with purchase because they understood. Hey, you know you would be spending over hundred dollars, and they trust me to come back, which was very nice. Uh, overall, I ended up spending seventy-one bucks. So I got the. Land Rover Defender. I got the last one on the shelf, so that was great. Everyone was picking this up. You know what I mean? It's a nice little set. Like, how could you go wrong with this? Yeah. Come on, you nice can't. Cool little build. And of course, I had to pick up this bad boy here. Come on, how can you go wrong with this? Fifty bucks, six hundred fifty-four pieces. This is gonna be such a fun set to have on display. Um, and I, I'm really looking forward to Lego making more of these. I feel like we could see one of these every year, every six months, especially with the pirate at, at the Lego house, and like. Yeah, let me get on the ground floor of this, you know? I'm not too big into the brick heads, but this is fun, right? So let's see how I like it. If I like it, I might have to buy the, the one at the Lego house. We'll see, though. And so, and, yeah. and that's that's the Lego store haul, but the vlog's not done yet. Titanium J is getting his reps in. Getting ready for a busy brick road. Oh, yeah, there we go. Bench press the Ninjago City Markets. There we go. Oh. Okay. We are outside now, doing doing a bit of trading. So, Richie has got this for me. I got this little set for TJ, which unfortunately he already has, I believe. But, but, but it is an army it's builder. It's Ninjago, it's an army builder, and knowing TJ, he's gonna find some use oh, for yeah. it in a future mock it, or something. It looks great. I love that, that boat is great. That boat alone, you can definitely build yeah. and do whatever you want with this. But you'll find something for it. Maybe a new vehicle for the city, I don't know. You want to start getting into vehicles. Yeah. But regardless, I got this for TJ. And then I've got a few things for Richie. First off, I have, it's heavy, I have a bunch of magazines, Lego Club magazines, that Richie was interested this in. This is enough to make a grown man cry. I might yeah. cry right now, because I made the mistake of throwing out my Lego Club magazines. And then we have the... Ninjago Dragons Rising. Oh, bag. you got that for me? Yeah. No way. Dude, you're found, an absolute I found legend. it early. I found it early. Not going to say where. Man. And then the. What is this? The Forest Hideout Castle GWB? I am too blessed. Which, which Richie actually helped me get in the first place. <laughs> back, in, back in August last year. So oh. I return it. Damn, TJ. Yeah. Too nice, man. Yeah. And uh, now, next uh, next shot, we're going to see me at home. All right, so I am back at home now. Uh, just to summarize all of the haul stuff, we have the flying jelly sub here from our toy world, from Richie. I'll have a link to his channel below, as well as to his vlog in the pinned comment. So check that out. Has the uh, GWP here. Not sure if I'm going to open this. Uh, we'll see. And then uh, we'll show Ninjago City Markets in a second, but I had some surprises waiting for me at home. I got a couple BrickLink orders in, got some different uh, Sig Fig parts here for Brick World Chicago, 
couple other random pieces. A Nindroid, of course, for the Nindroid army. Replacement skeleton arms. And my Brickalypse order finally came in. Uh, Brickalypse is a website that makes custom printed Ninjago figures and parts. So to start off here, we have a Ghost Klaus head. If that chooses to focus, there we go. A Casual Kai torso here, which is very nice. Uh, we have a Legacy 2 Zane. I have a custom printed human version of him, but I wanted the custom printed metal version as well. That face looks absolutely excellent. And finally, a young Garmadon, complete with red eyes. Very, very nice fig. But of course, the biggest part of this haul is Ninjago City Markets. This thing is absolutely huge and very, very heavy, as it turns out. Uh, I am so excited. Look at that lineup of minifigs there. So many great characters. It's unfortunate that the LEGO store had issues with selling the other Ninjago sets. I would have liked to pick up a spinner. I did actually stop by at Walmart and Target on my way home, but unfortunately they didn't have any of the spinners out or any of the smaller sets that I wanted to purchase. But I'll get those another day. Uh, anyway, that's going to do it for this vlog and haul. Hope you all enjoyed this. Uh, if, you, if you'd like to, feel free to leave a like down below, hit the subscribe button, and tell me what your favorite thing was in my haul here. Uh, tell me how you feel about the LEGO store not being able to sell sets that are supposed to be able to be sold. Uh, but that's going to do it for this video. Bye, everybody.